Have you ever been stuck without cell service, wishing you had downloaded Google Maps offline? Yeah, not fun. Let's fix that. Today, I'm showing you how to download Google Maps offline so you're never lost again. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Christopher Rudder, and here at Rudderless Media, we learn to travel and travel to learn. From travel apps and gear to planning and exploring destinations, we've got you covered. And today we're diving into a super practical tip that saved me countless times, downloading Google Maps for offline use. But before we dive in, let's talk about why this is so important. Do you remember that feeling of panic when you realize your map app isn't working? We've all been there, right? Imagine you're hiking a remote trail, navigating a foreign city, or in an area with unreliable cell service. And the foreign city doesn't even have to mean traveling by plane. As a Canadian, just heading south across the border means I'll be charged with high cellular roaming fees if we don't buy an electronic SIM card. On another occasion, we were road tripping way up north between Thunder Bay in Ontario and Winnipeg, Manitoba. At times, the cell service was brutal, which affected how our maps worked. Sometimes the map load time was delayed or the background would completely disappear and all that was left was this itty bitty little blue dot. We were literally driving blind with no map to guide us. It was stressful to say the least. Luckily, there was only one highway and we were heading in one direction. Where are you from, One Direction? Um... No, not the band. But if we had to detour due to a road closure, which is quite common that far north, it could have easily have been worse. The thing is, we always assume the internet is available. So when you suddenly don't have it, you wish you had downloaded Google Maps for offline use earlier. Okay, let's get to the good stuff. How to actually download the maps. First, you wanna make sure you're connected to Wi-Fi. Pro tip, I always do this step at home, just before leaving, as it's the most reliable option. Now, open your Google Maps app, and in the search bar, type the name of the destination, town, city, region, country, whatever. Tap X in the search bar to reveal your profile icon in the top right corner and tap that. Then tap Offline Maps. Now tap Select Your Own Map. Use two fingers to zoom in and out of the map and adjust the blue box to encompass the area you want to download. You'll see how much storage the map will use at the bottom of the screen. Once you've selected the area you want, tap the download button. You can also name your map. I usually name it something obvious like the city or region I'm downloading. Now you're all set. You can use this map even without an internet connection. Before we jump into offline navigation, only 1.1% of the people who watch my videos are actually subscribed. So if you're finding this video helpful and want to be a part of that awesome 1.1%, hit that subscribe button. You'll get notified of all my new videos packed with travel tips and new destinations. Now let's test it out. I've turned on airplane mode to simulate being offline. See, even without cell service, you can still use Google Maps to find places. Let's say I want to find the nearest gas station. I can type it into the search bar and there it is. I can even get directions from my current location to the gas station. Pretty cool, right? You can still zoom in and out, rotate the map and tap on places to see what they are. But keep in mind that some features might be limited offline. For example, you might not be able to see things like reviews, 
photos or real-time traffic updates. You need to be back online for that. Now you might be wondering, can I still use voice navigation offline? And unfortunately, it needs an internet connection. But don't worry, you can still see the turn-by-turn -turn directions on the screen. So where's the first place you'll go using offline maps? Let me know in the comments. And there you have it. Now you can confidently explore any place even without an internet connection. Speaking of exploring, if you're heading to a new city and want to create your own custom map, we're talking places you want to visit, transit options, and more, including, of course, downloading it offline. Then click the video on the right, and I'll see you over there. Either way, keep exploring, stay curious, and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers.